hello guys welcome to my channel you are watching how to fix stack in this video we will troubleshoot this issue memory management blue screen of death okay so this is directly related to the memory management it means that it manages the memory inside your computer and laptop so we need to make sure that we have enough memory inside our windows if not we can increase the memory with the virtual so go to here search bar type for advanced options now you will see this option view advanced system settings and you can access that this group as you can also access the advanced system property with the sys window plus r button together sys dm dot cpl this is for advanced user you can try also system dot cpl and you will get the same screen now under this system tab click on this option setting click on advanced option now click on this option virtual memory click on that and now i i have already given the virtual memory in my windows so how to assign the virtual memory okay it is recommended that you need to give the virtual memory 1.5 into how to calculate that if you have 4 gb ram i have 4 gb in my case so let me open the calci you need to enter the mb here 1024 into 4 this is the total mb of 4 gb 4096 now we need to into it into 1.5 now you will get this result okay 6144 the same you need to assign here if you are getting this option like this uncheck this option automatically manage paging file and then enter here the memory once you enter here the memory like this let me show you 6144 okay need to click on set click on okay click on okay click on okay and it will prompt to restart your system restart your system and then after follow the next step okay go to cmd and we will repair some command we will repair our windows right click on it run it as administrator now let me clear you again here if you have 8 gb ram 10 0 into 4 into 8 this into 1.5 if you have 8 gb you can assign the 12288 okay so we are in a cmd so now we need to type her sfc space slash scan now this will repair the corruption of windows files related to windows so wait for the process to complete and this will look like this once it is done i have this this will look like this verification completed successfully window resolver did not find any integration if you found it it will repair you will get the message once it is done restart your system after the restart make sure you are choosing the updated windows go to start menu click on setting click on update and security option now click on check for update and update all your windows pending updates and once it is done restart your system your issue should fix if still not fix go to device manager and we need to make sure that all the drivers are up to date open device manager first go to display driver and update this driver first search automatically and click close look for disk driver click on update and after that go to all the drivers you can update here this will boost your system performance as well as the error free system make sure all the drivers are updated here once it is done 
it should fix your issue if still not fix your issue we can move to the next method now if your issue is still persist we can run the memory diagnostic tap here memory and you will see here my memory diagnostics result click on run it as administrator and restart your system this process might take 30 to 40 minutes but this will give you the result if any corruption inside your memory also on the physical level you can clean the ram and reattach it or you can change its port and check if your issue is solved or not if still not solved if still not solved we can go to the cmd again and we will repair the hard drive issue this command will repair all the hard drive issues, SSD issues, type as chkdsk space slash f space slash r. R will repair bad sector, f will repair the corruption inside your hard drive. Click on Y and restart your system. Once you enter Y and enter, restart your system, this process will take 3 to 4 hours, but this is very powerful command. This will repair all the corruption as well as the hard drive related issues. So apply these methods and comment if your issue is solved or not. If your issue is solved, then hit like, subscribe and share. Thank you. Thanks for watching how to fix that.